welcome to gc ready technologies html basics for selenium html uh, html stands for hypertext markup language it is language but not like java python perl etc in html uh, no control flow statements conditional statements loop statements etc it is tag based language uh, what is the purpose of html i think all of you familiar with uh, what is html html is for web page design why html for our selenium see selenium supports web application testing web testing functional testing type test type functional testing next application type web applications selenium doesn't support desktop applications selenium supports web applications so we need to familiar with web testing web applications see html hypertext markup language for web page design say functional test tools like selenium uh, or functional test tools are object or element based test tools based on front end objects they perform test operations uh, not only selenium you take any functional test tool uft rft silk test uh, test complete etc they perform test operations based on front end objects or in our selenium terminology elements see terminology may vary from one environment to another but uh, meaning is same for example in eft unified functional testing formerly qtp we call object software object in selenium test environment we call element both are same say uh, functional test tools are object based test tools based on front end objects they perform test operations for example enter a value into username edit box here edit box is object or element next enter password into password edit box here password edit box involvement click sign in button button involvement uh, next performance test tools like load runner j meter uh, rpt etc protocol based test tools based on protocols <coughs> http https odbc jdbc etc protocols they perform test operations okay our our selenium performs test operations based on front end objects uh, so we need to familiar with the web ui user interface okay say one exemption is there for conducting database testing database testing is a subset of functional testing for conducting database testing no front end object or element reference is required but for most of the test operations front end objects are reference required so familiar with front end objects or elements see web or html elements say i think all of you familiar with this uh, web elements for example powerful object or element in the web link button edit box radio button check box drop down box list box combo box image or uh, next to uh, this one text area comment box etc next frames web frames are html frames frames are not uh, elements uh, frames frame means a section of web page uh, it may contain elements okay next media html media say nowadays in most of the web applications you can find html media for example uh, audio files in html pages audio files 
video files are come under media familiar with uh, html elements frames and media next element locators and attributes see our selenium <coughs> locate elements based on element locators selenium supports eight element locators id name class name link text partial link text next uh, css selector xpath next some attributes are there for example alt attribute title attribute Fam uh, familiar with attributes alt attribute title attribute next uh, uh, type attribute suppose type attribute of edit box text type attribute of password edit box password encrypted next type attribute of button submit etc next actions on web elements say in general life uh, in real life also we browse several websites in internet i think uh, you all are familiar with the actions on elements you need to familiar with actions on element for selenium locating elements that is one task next performing actions on elements uh, actions suppose link link is element action on the element click uh, if you click that one it redirects from one location to another next button button is element action on the element is click if you click click is action what is the functionality it submits next edit box is element enter a value is action that value is parameter next a radio button select an option action next check box check is a, is action for that we use click next one second you uh, if you click uncheck next drop down box select an item so familiar with the actions on web elements or html elements next html document say uh, html document web designers or web developers uh, use html documents we no need to write html documents but know the concept of html documents here <clears throat> editor editor for writing html code uh, <clears throat> generally uh, notepad text editor notepad default extension is txt uh, you launch notepad enter html code save as dot html then that is html file uh, if you click that file browser will launch the web page editor for writing html document and browser for launching <coughs> html pages browser for launching and navigating html pages next familiar with already I told <coughs> html is tag based language predefined tags next one more markup language is there xml extensible markup language uh, that is also tag based language but their user defined tags but in html predefined tags are uh, familiar with uh, h1 h2 h3 h4 header header 1 2 3 4 5 6 next p p for paragraph see all these tags for writing content on web pages uh, next body html tag table uh, next sub tags in table tr table rows td table data next input input tag uh, next button tag a famous tag a for anchor for link elements a uh, anchor tag img image tag etc next already i told html doesn't support control flow 
so how to <coughs> validate client side requests for that web developers uh, integrate script components into html tags for example javascript javascript can be embedded with html for client side validations next enhancing web user interface web ui say for enhancing web interface web user interface developers web developers use cascading style sheets flash objects etc so familiar with html concepts for selenium web testing 